short video how to improve and develop your Daddy, drawing skill in this video we're going to take a look five tips to draw fast a little bit one to draw Very faster well. the truth is that i want to reveal the secret for help to improve your drawing skills and ironically accurate as well so let's take a look at this row quickly before we go deep in a minute first tips is to draw what you see mean that look for an object and draw the basic shapes second tip is to draw with your whole arms swinging loosely and lightly in a sketch manner with the pencil head under your arm keep it light keep it light so you won't need to erase or damage the paper third tip is to make comparison with the picture plans you can see it's very light that means and it's very thin you line, should very thin line, have a proper study you on your object your in, in order to overview correct, the basic change. shapes That's generally four tips so for breaking it down, is to use a different medium use different medium means that you can use pencil from pencil to pastel to watercolor to color pencil and so on this is the one over one shelf this is another shelf fifth tips i'm going with the second detail to omit detail that. that might not be necessary in the that. object they have an edges that means that you I have to, have to go after the uh, the necessary detail and to come out with good shading so any line that is not necessary yeah, the two within head. the object two you can omit head. it and it has a space that's where you your observing works so you have well. to show all so, this thank you for listening to this that shows that you, you make can a good study watch the video objects. and you will see all what i'm talking about so there's a mistake here there's a little thank space you within before the handle so you have to make it you correct it you can see the line the first line i have under it because it's not it's not useful here yeah. it's just a guideline for you to make a proper shape you understand that's why you have to go with this and it's like there's a transparent in the objects so you make all those things you make them as a one as a lines you pronounce them as a line you know that's what we see now You can see the outcome is coming out a little a little bit. You are able to bring it out. And uh, to show you a little shading about this, because I can just draw everything detail here, you know, for the time. It's a, it's a short video, but I have to show you the basic shape. That's why I'm doing all this for you, for you to see how you can make your own. Just to indicate. Now, for the shading I'm seeing, this is what I'm seeing. I told you it's a transparent stuff. So you draw what you see. This is inner shape from behind, as you can see. And you can see a little dark shot here in the handle. That is show the thickness of the bot the bottle. And there's a little dark here within the light, light tendency of the, 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 the tendency of light, the reflection of light here. Yeah. To show the transparency of the bar too. That's what I'm doing here. There's a tiny light here, not obviously showed very well, but shading can cover it.
the cover, it shows a little bit in the bottom. This place I have to die because the light is not reached this side. So you have to show the effect of the light on it. Also go with this. And you came out a little bit. You can see the way I'm doing my shade. I'll go by the shapes. Because the shapes will tell you how to apply your shading. And if you can go with the form of the shape, you get your shade right. So that's how I do it. You can see how determined I came about with this. So that does it. Thank you for watching this video. And you can see, let me bring out the the shadow cast for you to see it very well. There's a transparent behind this, and the bottom after dark, so that your object will not be floating. You have to show that. This is how I saw. This is how I'm seeing the reflect the shadow reflect. And the white, this one is the base. You have to show this line. For you to understand that it's standing on the surface. Maybe on a, a little shade on the floor. I'm sorry. Wow. This is how I sign my signature whenever I finish my drawing. Thank you.